hello guys and welcome again so in this video we'll be looking at how we can create um member functions remember we said that um we we an object has attributes and um behaviors so these behaviors become the data members the the data functions why the attribute becomes the data member so i'm going to show you how you can create a data member so here we're going to be creating sorry data uh, member functions so member functions so um in this student class let's say we want to do void display um student right so i want to do display student right so we can do this oh sorry it has to be within the class right so we can do that within the class right in the public section or we can do that out of a class right so i'm going to this is let me just do this within the class and then later on i'm show you how to do it outside of the class so let's just say that we have called this func uh, member data so i'll just do a c out here and i'll do welcome to member functions call right N line so if i want to do that i'll just come here and let's say we, i can just do ange dot display student right and that is going to to work very well yes that's supposed to work very well so it will just display welcome to member function call right so that is it that is how you create uh, a member function and that is how you, you use it so you, when, when you create an object an object now can assess the member data and also the member function so remember we've created um Ange here and Ange can assess x which is here right and it can also access these members now i was talking about creating a member